My name is Sarah, Mr. Robert Makoha Wangoho. I'm Bungala Manaji President in Akuru County. This morning, na chukua hii furusa, kuomba watu wafanya kiti na hito subscription kwa hizi media houses ambazo munaona mbele enu. Ya kwanza na hitoa Real Stories Media, subscribe. Asulab Media, subscribe. Kuna Check TV, subscribe. Kuna ndugetu wa na hitoa Fletcher. TV subscribe kwa channel yake na mwingine anaitwa Sao Paul TV na mwingine anaitwa Nakuru Today TV ukisubscribe utapata information yetu ya bunge yote na vile tunatetea mwananchi wa chini asanteni sana now my first point is about eh, siku ya jana siku ya jana kumekuwa na international girls day and I say happy International Girls Day to all our women, to all our girls. However, there is a misunderstanding among us, especially the officials of Kenya. Jana Niliona, Minister, Minister was Sports and Gender, Agikimbia kwa streets, na watoto wa stana, wamebeba matawi, na baadaye wakaenda mahali wakapata kitu ambayo inaitwa sodo kwa Kiswahili. Now, let me remind you Kenyans. Celebrating an international uh, special day should be accompanied by some improvements to the girl child as we are speaking. Today there is what we call the moral degradation of the girl child in Africa. But what the CS was doing yesterday in Nakuru County and even in Nairobi and other counties was so embarrassing. Who told you that while celebrating an International Girls' Day is always occasioned by distribution of sanitary towels alone? Who told you that celebration of International Girls' Day is accompanied by saying that a girl can do better than a boy. That is bullshit. Wake up and smell the coffee. You must have a proper understanding of an international gas day. Chenye nilikuwa natarajia, mulikungekua munaambia wasitana wetu, umuhimu, wamila na tamaduni za kiafrika kama mwanamuke. Chenye nilitarajia kuona, mungekua munaadvise watoto wetu, umuhimu, wakueshimu bwana zao vile Afrika inataka muonde hii maneno yenye huwa mnasema amani is equal to rahman that one cannot happen ningekuwa natarajia mwambie hawa wasichana umuhimu wa kuheshimu bwana kwa nyumba na muwaelimishe pia umuhimu wa kuacha kupata mimba za ovyo ovyo kabla ya ndoa kwa sababu tumepoteza wasichana wetu, wetu wengi sana wakiwa shuleni wengine wako form 1 wana drop out due to early pregnancies i did not see any single woman advocating for that right of a girl child i did not hear any woman discouraging a uh, mustana kuwa na boyfriend watano na hajui hali zao za kiafya hayo ndio mambo yanakandamiza kenya Kuna wasichana wenye nilikuwa nafikiria kama ni role models kama Akothe. Huyu mwanamuziki Akothe nilifikiria amepata pesa atatumia opportunity mzuri kuelimisha watoto wasichana. Lakini ame, ame turn out to be a very bad role model to the rest of the girl generation. Na ndio maana kuna shule fulani huko Migori ilimkatalia the principal alisema no na aka cancel hiyo appearance yenye akode alifaa kwenda kuapia na kuongelesha watoto wasichana akode wenye mnamfuatilia amekuwa na mabwana wazungu na anajipiga kifua leo ako na huyu bwana mzungu kesha ana mdamu anaenda kwa mwingine leo ako na manager wake Nelly Ok kesho ako na baby daddy ako na wanaume kumi bora tu pesa Hayo ndio maneno tungetaka watu wasikilize kwa makini na waadvise wasichana wetu kwa International Girls Day sio kupewa wasichana sanitary towels 
peke yake alafu najipiga ikifua you empowered that girl child we are on earth we are an advanced nation only corruption is our problem now if you someone a girl na unamfunza vile yeye anatoshana na mwanamume kwa nyumba yeye analeta nini if una someone msichana na unamwambia ukue na wanaume watano na uzae na wao watoto tofauti tofauti unamfunza nini ndio maana hapo zetu tulikuwa tunamwambia huyu jamaa wa mwisho ambaye anaitwa Steve Sgi Sweet ama nani mwenye alimpea jina ya Omosh wali spend millions of shillings yes si kutoa na si kualikwa lakini you cannot hold a very noble wedding mpaka umealika mama wa taifa mama huu eh, Aida Odinga umealika all the dignitaries wameaten then merely one man ndio nasema umedambu huyo mwanaume ati utatafuta mwingine ati wao alikuwa ameoa hakukwambia that is bullshit we want our kenyan women and public figures to encourage the girl child on the importance of upholding human dignity and respecting the african culture that is one